At tonight's Tucson Mayor and Council meeting, the audience didn't stick to the agenda. A group of local climate activists filling the call to the audience, talking instead about a city-directed study analyzing different ways to get electric power to Tucsonans. Kega 9's Alex Dowd has details on why some members of the community are concerned this energy sourcing study won't be taken seriously by Mayor and Council. Local climate activists like Lee Zishi and concerned Tucsonans filled the audience of Tuesday's council meeting. There to show their interest in an energy sourcing study. Thousands of people in Tucson are paying attention to this feasibility study and we want them to do a rigorous study. Person after person stepped up to the podium, many sharing stories of debilitating electricity bills in the summer or explaining concerns for the environment. Starting in August, the city of Tucson began a study on the many different ways that they could keep your lights turned on. The energy sourcing study is led by GDS Associates and weighs options like TEP against renewable energy or public power. That's the one Z she's interested in. They tend to be a lot cheaper, they have fewer outages, they're better on climate action, and that's because they don't exist to make somebody money. You know, they just exist to serve the people. The energy sourcing study will finish in May of 2025. A TEP spokesperson told Kagan that they're paying attention to the results of this study, but they don't expect a change in power providers will be seen as feasible. From downtown, Alex Dowd, KGUN 9.